Puffed the magic dragon, lived by the sea, and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Little Jackie Paper loved that rascal Puff, and brought him strings and sealing wax and other fancy stuff. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Together they would travel on a boat with billowed sail. Jackie kept a lookout, perched on Puff's gigantic tail. Noble kings and princes would bow whenever they came, and pirate ships would lower their flag when Puff roared out his name. Oh, Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. A dragon lives forever, but not so little boys. Painted wings and giant rings make way for other toys. One gray night it happened, Jackie Paper came no more, and Puff the mighty dragon seized his fearless roar. Oh, Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. His head was bent in sorrow. Green scales fell like rain. Puff no longer went to play along the cherry lane. Without his lifelong friend, Puff could not be brave. So Puff the mighty dragon sadly slipped into his cave. Puff the mighty dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu. Puff the magic dragon lived by the sea and frolicked in the autumn mist in a land called Honolulu.